Hola, es Gaby here and today I'm going to make a car using my glass um, paints. I was cleaning part of my craft room and I found them and I said let me use this that I haven't used for a long, long, long time. I am um, stamping strawberries in posted tape. Now I, I stamp a jar in acetate and I'm stamping now the strawberries in acetate using um oh my god i forget the name of that um, ink it calls uh, uh stas stas um. okay when i'm finished stamping i turn then um the side that i stamp i turn them down and I stamp them, uh, can we say, to in, in the reverse of the of the stamping. Uh, I color in, coloring them with a glass paint because I want to give them like a transparency. Um, and I color them to the rest to keep the, the seeds of the strawberry when you turn them uh, over. I color them in... Uh, red and uh, of course <laughs> the leaves in green but for when I color in the the leaves uh, I didn't wait for the red to to dry I didn't have to wait for the red to dry When I was doing this car, I received mail uh, with the uh, Queen and Co. Um, fruits, and I decided to make some fruit, fruits using the same technique. I going to uh, I, I I want to still trying to do something with these uh, paints, glass paints. Um, I make another video that is going to be. Uh, upload very soon uh, it's like the second part of, of this one Okay, now they are um, dry and I'm going to stamp the sentiment and the sentiment I'm going to measure the frame and the acetate um, with the paper that's going to be under and I stamp the sentiment inside the paper. I didn't want to use more of the Stasson ink or um, I, it, it made the same effect. It's the, it's the sentiment is inside or outside the car. And rather to be inside the car is uh, simple and faster. Um, after that, I'm going to to um, use my foam tape to go all around this um, piece of paper. That I add this extra piece of paper. You can, if you want to do something like this you can go directly to your car base that's it but i didn't think this very well and i did the first thing this paper and then glue it to my car base but i make it a little bit more uh, heavier not bulky but it's not that bulky but heavier and after that i glue after i take the um, the thing, the protector of the foam tape, I glue my acetate and I cut a little bit of the pieces that, of the acetate that were hanging outside. And after that, I'm going to add um, 
double sided stick tape to my frame and glue my frame. What I was looking here is to the strawberries can make a reflection on the white paper, but I think for this I need to double or triple my font tape. But I didn't do it in this case. And you have to be aware that it's going to be bulkier. Uh, the card is going to be bulkier. I don't see that much. I don't think it matters to put in the envelope, but um, just people, some people doesn't like cards to be that bulky. After I glue the frame, I'm going to glue my card, put it onto my card base. Um, after that, I'm going to decorate with some uh, red jewels uh, around the card. Um, that will be it. I um, mark some points in the, the strawberry in the bottom look weird, I think, because the ink um, slip a little bit uh, when you stamp in acetate it's a little bit slippery even even if you press too much the the misty or whatever stamping tool you have uh, it's a little bit tricky but not impossible and also I don't know if the stance that starts on ink is so permanent that it's just scratching with your finger when your uh, fingernail is going to uh, go away I don't know about that. But this is the card for today. Thank you for watching. I hope you like it. Until next card. Bye.